Hey everybody, Jeff here from Outseta. Today I'm gonna to highlight one of the use cases we don't talk about too much at Outseta, which is how Outseta can be used to run a, a freelancing or consulting business. So when I'm not working on Outseta, I do some consulting focused on growth strategy for, for SaaS companies. And I wanted to put together a website for my consulting business very quickly, very easily, uh, inexpensively and using just card to build the website and Outseta, I ended up in a place where I have a pretty sophisticated tech stack, much like a much larger business would have uh, in less than an hour. And this is an awesome fit for any sort of freelancer or consultant that sells their services on a retainer basis. And one of the benefits here is rather than sending invoices to your clients each month and trying to keep track of who's paid you and who hasn't, if you use Outseta to collect your payments, you're going to get paid on time every single month reliably without needing to chase clients for invoices. So if you've done freelancing for a while, you know that that's a huge benefit. And beyond that, Card is ridiculously easy to work with and very inexpensive. And then Outseta gives you not just the billing and invoicing, but a CRM to keep track of your consulting clients, email marketing tools so you can communicate with them, help desk tools so you can field incoming requests from your clients and also reporting all in a single platform. So let's take a look at the site and then how I set it up. What you see on my screen right now uh, is my consulting website and it is very basic. It's basically just a picture of me. Uh, it introduces the name of the company. Uh, I give you a little blurb about how I work at Outseta and also do some consulting. Uh, and then there's just a few pages of content. I spent less than half an hour putting all of this together. Uh, I've got an about page where I kind of introduce myself and my skill set. I've got a testimonials page so people can uh, read what other people that have worked with me had to say about the experience. I've got a contact page so people know how to get in touch with me if they want to. And then most importantly, I have this hire me button. So if someone comes to my site and they say, great, I wanna work with Jeff, there doesn't have to be any back and forth. They can click hire me. This opens out set a sign up embed and they can immediately choose the option that works best for them. So in this scenario, I offer some two hour working sessions and then I offer some uh, either monthly meetings or weekly meetings to help companies with growth strategy. If a customer comes here and says, I want to sign up for monthly meetings, they can just select that option and move right through checkout. The money shows up automatically in my Outseta account, and then I can redirect the customer to schedule their meetings with me via Calendly. So that's how the site works, really basic stuff, but how do you go about setting this up? So to start, uh, you do need to create an Outseta account. I've done that over here. And then if you go to Card's website, Card gives you the option of choosing a starting point, uh, or you can just start building from a blank slate. I did choose a starting point. So if you click choose a starting point and you scroll down this all section, the template that I used for this particular site, uh, let's find it real quick, uh, is this one right here. Uh, and I'll link to this in the article, but you can click on a demo of it. You can see that it looks quite similar to my site. All I did whatsoever was change the colors and uh, upload a picture of myself, obviously. But the website is already designed. Literally, I just had to copy and paste uh, my own content into this site template. And it's card template number 32. So now let's look at how the site is actually built. This is uh, me now logged into card and you can see that there's different sections within card for each of these buttons about testimonials, contact and hire me. All I had to do is jump in here and add in the content that I wanted to, but there's only two things that were required to bring this fully functional website to life. The first one is I added uh, a code block down here. So this is an embed in card. You need to come up here uh, and drag an embed element onto the page. I added it all the way at the bottom and I added uh, a code embed. I labeled it the outset of quick start script. This is going to be um, hidden and in the header. And it's just a little bit of code that you grab from your Outseta account. So if I jump into Outseta and I come to Auth and Embeds, we provide this quick start head script right here. This is all I had to add to my site. 
So that's what you see here. I then click done. What that does is it allows Outsetas sign up embed to open as a pop-up. So if I click on that hire me button, as I did before, you saw it uh, opened a, a sign up form. Uh, and this hire me button, if I click on it, just links to a URL that's also provided by Outseta. So to get that URL, you need to go into your Outseta account. And there's a few things you're going to do first. You're going to come to billing and settings and connect out set it to Stripe. So payments get processed through Stripe, but once you connect to Stripe, you can really forget that your Stripe account exists. Secondarily, you're gonna to come to billing and plans. I added my three plan options here. Uh, my two hour working session is a one-time plan. The two other plans are monthly recurring plans. But once I connected to Stripe and added those plans, then all I had to do is come to uh, auth and embeds, right where I grabbed that quick start header script, there is a sign up link that you see right here. I grab that sign up link, I jump back into card, and I append that sign up link to that hire me button. That tells card when someone clicks on that hire me button, open up outside of sign up embed and present the user with the different plan options uh, that I offer. So that's all that it took to build this website. One other note is if you do come to auth sign up and login, because I'm not using Outsetas login functionality right now, uh, I've turned off our confirmation email. Uh, and then on the sign up settings section, I've just requested an email address, the person's name, and made an organization name optional. That's the only information that needs to be completed for somebody to sign up and purchase uh, any of my consulting options. But that's the totality uh, of how to set this up. Uh, from there, uh, you will see every time somebody signs up and purchases uh, a session, they will show up um, as an account with an outset of CRM. You've got email marketing tools you can use to communicate with your client base. You've got a help desk where you can uh, publish how-to content in a knowledge base or receive support tickets from your consulting clients. Uh, of course, you can change billing plans or add new products anytime you want to offer them to your customer base. And you also have reporting tools to report on your financial performance. But that's how I built this consulting website really in less than 30 minutes. If you have any questions on this whatsoever, please let me know. Thanks so much.